Hello viewers, in this video I'll be going over Gold Miners Jr. ETF ticker symbol GDXJ. Today we are up 3.5% on the one hour chart. We are currently overbought on the RSI. Same as on the four hour RSI, we are also overbought. And on the daily chart, we are touching overbought territory on the daily RSI as well. And for the MACD, we started to converge up. So for resistance, I do see resistance that dated back to even past year. One resistant will be at September 6, 2017. And another resistance that also coincides with that price is also back in March 2017 and same as in January 18, 2017. So I'll mark that as resistance since these price coincides with each other. I do see there is some ceiling to be shaped and for support, I do see support at the 9 day and 18 day moving average and that also coincides with past resistance which acts as support now that support also coincides with February 20th of this year so I'll mark that as support and we see a slight support area right down here as well so I'm confident instead of turning back lower we may head upward and sideways for a while so that is positive sign for the bulls on to the next module and here i'll forecast where gdxj or gold miners jr will head to the next coming days so one day out two days out three days out four days out five days out six days out and seven days out so which of these are the most reliable forecasts I'll point out or I'll give you a reason through comparison so I'll compare today's current trend right here with this trend down here that dated back to June 21st 2012 to September 17 2012 I'll point out why these two charts are similar so what we have here in the beginning of the trend we have a downtrend right down here and we quickly reverse to go higher one right here and we see a touch on the upper Bollinger Band and we see a slight reversion to the mean not quite touching the middle Bollinger Band but we proceeded to go on higher as well touching once more on the upper Bollinger Band and right down here we start to see similar patterns we see a downtrend down here and then we touch the upper Bollinger Band right here and then we reverted back to the mean as detailed in here and then after that we continue on higher to touch the upper Bollinger Band just like where we were at current trend so what we have is one two three four points one two three four points as well so there's reason to believe that the trends and patterns are the same the forecast would also be the same so right back down here the trend that we took a look at was right here June 21st 2012 to September 17 2012 and back then gold miners junior was down roughly two point percent so but overall I do see the trend is favoring the upside so we might have a slight dip in the next coming days and here's the line chart that I compared it to we have the current trend and the 2012 trend so that is all if you enjoy this content feel free to like subscribe and comment and thank you for watching